later. First of all, prayers, all prayers go out to everyone that was dealing with um, the loss of heat, electricity, um, what else, like freezing water. cold, water, yeah. Okay. Um, whatever. In whatever Texas. Needs, yeah. Um, I got some friends in Texas. From what I know, they've been pretty good, but a couple of them did experience like lack of heat, lack of power for days. That shit is crazy. You never realize how much you take for granted that type of shit. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I'm one of them folks who be like, when I get in the shower and the water's hot, mm. I am so grateful because <laughs> I can't take no cold showers. Same here. I, well, I can't do it, son. Even in the summer. Even in the summer, I can't do it. Really? Yeah. Like, I'll take a warm shower. Maybe a warm <laughs> shower. But, <laughs> but my nigga, my crib could be on fire. I'm not taking no cold shower. It's just not in. But cold showers are mad healthy for you, too. Yeah. Man, healthy for you, but I just can't do it. I took, I take majority like ninety to ninety five percent hot, like yeah, steaming hot, not warm, no, oh. like upper. But I wouldn't say hot, hot. But it's not it's like what the, women like. Women like that shit, like well, hell. I, that's hot. what I heard. But women got a high tolerance for that shit, bro. My shit be hot, but I, like I like my shit. Yeah, yeah, but um, yeah. No winter mornings. I'll be I'll be standing up until that shit turn hot. I'll be like Nah, I don't get in the shit until it's hot. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'll yeah. be looking at the water. Oh like, yeah, 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 yeah. You better warm up. Like yeah. fuck, I'm not, I'm not jumping in that shit. So um, you know, in the midst of all this, the mayor of Colorado City, um his name is Tim Boyd. He released a dumb. I don't know if you heard about this. Mm-mm. He released a dumbass statement, and I wanna. It's quite a lot. I'm gonna read it. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna read it. Right. Wait, is Colorado City in Texas? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yep. All right. Here's what he said. Right. This is in the midst of everything going on. Not to mention the governor flew to fucking Mexico with his daughters and his family and shit. Then he came back on something like, "Oh yeah, you know, it was a mistake. Why you went out there, my nigga?" He bailed on us. Yeah, you know I'm saying like that's a bad. You niggas well, don't he like. He bailed on y'all. Like we like we know y'all texting. fuck turds, and we know that y'all niggas ain't got no brain. But like, you don't know that's a bad look. Like, in order to protect your image, you don't think that was a bad look. Like, he don't care. Y'all where's y'all publicists? Where's y'all yeah. like nobody giving y'all a little insight on the inside? Like, yo, I don't think that's a good move, my nigga. Like niggas is literally can't leave their crib. You going to Mexico? He like they don't fuck it. It's they met life. him at the it's, airport it's on the life. other side. Like yo, it's my last here. term. The fuck? What y'all gonna do? <laughs> yo, niggas what y'all gonna do? Uh, y'all gonna y'all gonna um Res- impeach me? Right? Y'all gonna impeach my last year in this bitch. Imagine a fucking <laughs> elected official acting like that. What you gonna do? Impeach me? That's basically what they are doing without saying it. That's what all of them are doing. Yeah. All right. So let me read this shit. He said, "Ain't look." He started off with some, he started off with like some very like petty shit. He said, let me hurt some feelings while I have a minute. Off the rip, he, he, off the rip, he chose <laughs> off the violence. Rip, he, <laughs> off the rip, he on his Donald Trump. Yeah. Is he a Republican? I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty, I mean, he is right. a mayor of a city in Texas, a red state. So it's, oh. it's most likely he's a he's Republican. But yeah. um, he said, no one, he said, no one owes you he said, no one owes you or your family anything, nor nor is it the local government's responsibility to support you during trying times like this. Sink or swim, it's your choice. The city and the county, along with power providers or any other services, owe you nothing. Even though we paying these niggas to keep our lights on, they owe us nothing. All right, I'll continue. Um, I'm sick and tired of people... Looking for a damn handout. See, uh, I don't mean to cut it, cut it off, but like that's like that's that like very conservative like mindset. Like, like niggas want decency and niggas want shit they paying for, but we looking for a handout. My it's, nigga, I'm I'm paying you niggas to keep my shit on. It's like when <laughs> see this is this is this is all right. So that right there is like when black people are requesting reparations justice and reparations right. and they tell us pull yourselves up by the bootstrap it's the exact I same i said that thing. same shit to somebody in the dm that 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 bootstrap i said the same shit son somebody you know too i ain't, I ain't gonna but put now them out there everybody is getting it and this is where the government is basically drawing a line in the sand saying like yo we creating this fucking 
uh, permanent upper class, permanent lower class. Mm-hmm. Fuck y'all niggas. Right. And by y'all niggas, I mean Chinese, white, black, Spanish. Yeah, literally. I mean, it's if, like, if your economic bracket says nigga on it, yeah. fuck you. Economic bracket, yeah, it's a fact. So he carries on. He says, um, along with pet providers or any other services, owe you nothing. I'm sick and tired of people looking for a damn handout. If you don't have electricity, you step up and come up with a game plan to keep your family warm and safe. If you have no water, you deal without what <laughs> so what are we paying taxes for literally i said the same nigga, what are shit we paying taxes i said for? the that's same that's literally shit, what we're paying look, taxes for and look and this is our guy the person who referenced in my mind who i'm speaking to the dm this is our guy this, this, this is our, our guy. guy and he he gonna listen to this episode steven he gonna listen to this episode oh man what, y'all, y'all but, bump heads on but this look <laughs> Steven is my guy. I'm going to explain afterwards. I kind of understand some of his points, but, I, but I'm going to explain why I have rebuttals, right? So he said, um, if you have no water, you deal with foul and think outside the box to survive. All right. So what the fuck? Mm-hmm. Like, um, and supply water to your family. If you are sitting at home in the cold because you have no power and are sitting there waiting for someone to come rescue you because you're... Your lazy is direct result of your raising. Only the strong will survive and we will perish. Are we in the fucking Stone Age? Nah, we Y'all niggas are not. Into like, games. this nigga himself ain't out in the fucking, in the wild, hunting animals and, and, and making fire with sticks. But he got the nerve to tell niggas that, yo, all right, I'm, I'm going to finish. Mm-hmm. Um, He said, only the strong. Wait, I just need. <laughs> Come on now. No, ain't you. Bless me. Annoying you. Annoying me. Only the strong will survive and weak will perish. Folks, God has given us the tool to support ourselves in times like this. This is sadly a product of a socialist government where they feed people to believe that the few will work and others will become dependent on handouts. Am I sorry that you are dealing with with foul electricity and water, yes. But I'll be damned if I'm going to provide for anyone that is capable of doing it themselves. We have lost sight of those in need and those um, and those to take advantage of the system and mesh them into one group. Which, he has a point with that. Because I agree. A lot of you niggas... A lot of you niggas came up off that unemployment and y'all niggas did not need it. And niggas that did need it, they didn't get a chance to get it. Cause, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But... Let's need a hero there. Um, People missed out on unemployment. I have a friend that um like yeah no nah, I have a friend that like she for some reason like she did, she wasn't eligible to do it during quarantine because like uh like maybe she oh uh, I think she filed for it sooner than that and like it's only like a certain period of time that you can get it but like during quarantine like the whole even since last year she wasn't able to like. Like benefit from like the extra hundred. Mm-hmm. That's weird. They didn't like re-enroll her. Like that shit was clipped for her. For some, I, I don't know how that shit used works. To scam. That's why. Nah, nah, the nah. Was like, nah. Nah, we know. You nah, know. I don't think so. She don't <laughs> come. Up, she don't come up that way. But <laughs> all right, I'm about to be done with this shit. Um, he said we have lost sight of those in need and they'll take advantage of the system and mesh them in in one group. Bottom line: quit crying, looking for a handout. Get off your ass and take care of your family. Bottom line. Um, don't be a part of the problem. Be a part of the solution. This is Tom. Uh, this is Tim Boyd, mayor of Colorado City in Texas. You got any words before I? I have some words. Do you have time? Sure, sure. Because because I already have what I have okay. my head and what I said to. <clears throat> no, nah, mine is pretty straight. All right, so you may be surprised, but I agree and disagree with what he said. I agree with some points. Now. It's context, though. I agree. Though. Yeah, it's context. Now, because of the amount of fear that governments constantly pump into its citizens and the current predicament Texans are in, that is fucked up to say. In terms of empathy and morale, yeah, that I would say that. Yeah, that's just and fucked it, up. That is definitely not compassionate. Not at all. Now, you are very, because of that, you have exuded that you are unfit to be a representative of us, even your family. 
In, in terms of disaster, that's how you gonna talk to your children and shit. Like right. that, that makes no sense. Handle it. You got no water. Just figure the fuck it out. What's wrong with you? Now, in terms of lazy people, and I do mean lazy. I do agree with him. Mm-hmm. There are people who ride the system. For a fact. Yeah, he's a hundred percent right. There's able-bodied people that do not go out look for employment. Do not apply themselves. Do not you know rise above, rise to the challenge, whatever. You know, you know, they mm-hmm. just look for, they just constantly play the victim and play the vi- blame game. Mm-hmm. They, 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 ha- they are not friends with e- responsibility nor accountability. Mm-hmm. So in terms of that, yeah, I agree with, uh, you know, what he's saying. Now, I, in conclusion, I would say this, like, I hope those words, people in Texas, people in America, people across the world, take it and use it as fuel because this is what we're going to be seeing around the planet yeah. in multiple governments if not all of them yeah after that's why i made sure i, men- I mentioned after they pump the fear into you so they know how y'all was going to react mm-hmm. to all to pl- it's it's all a ploy bro it's right. all a ploy but you can right. go ahead so my um my my rebuttal to Stephen, he um, and not even to put him out there because everyone, everyone's entitled to their own, their own views and opinion. But no, um, we all disagree with each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, his point was basically, and I agree to a certain extent. His point basically was, um, then I would just let me see if I could go to it because it was um, I don't. Yeah, I was texting. Nah, we was in the DM. We was in the DM. Yeah, yeah, right. Because yeah. I um. Writing. Well, I, I say this. People tend to misconstrue the writing at times. Tone when it's writing. Sure. Sure. Wait. Where the fuck is it? This was... All right. Yeah. Uh, what he said. Damn. My bad, y'all. I'm like stumbling right now. All right. Bet. Nah. This is not even... All right, here it goes. Here it goes. My bad, my bad, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. This guy is nervous. I'm, I'm in the DM here. trying to... Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Never nervous. All right, he said... Basically, what he said was, he said it all the time, stop depending on the government. And yeah, I... I agree with that, yeah. And I, I look, to say And that. I understand that. Fuck the government. But you can't, like... We can't group everyone in this group of, like... Like some people are old, some people are, some people are just not aware of shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, like that's what I was not saying. everybody is a fucking woke person. Not everybody's in the deep state. Not everybody's like, bro. Some people are living in this country, and they would like to believe that their that their tax money is going to these government officials. That are going to be there for assistance if they need it. And these companies, these water companies, electric companies, I'm paying my bills. So, like, my thing was for him was like, we want niggas to wake up one day and believe, you know what? If some shit goes wrong, I'm going to be able to fucking create a generator in my crib. I'm going to be able to know how to fucking plant food. Like, some niggas don't, we can't expect, like, not everybody is going to. The whole population ain't going to be like us. You know what I'm saying? But see, that's what it is. We got to... People need to... But you got to have sympathy for those who are not, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? But initiative. Yes, I understand that. Not not everybody's... Not everybody you can't is say... going to have the same level of initiative, but at the same time, it's like, come on. like. So you it's like have okay. no initiative like for yourself, like at least? Look. The that's, nigga, how, that's how we... The mayor at. said, if you don't have water, do without. How the fuck you going to do without water, my nigga? But I'm supposed to supplement it with juice? The black guy in Texas <laughs> created that machine that creates water out of the moisture in the air. Yeah, not everybody's a scientist. But everybody got fucking cash app, a credit card, a debit card. What that mean? They could buy the machine. I mean, it's a, it's, Come on. it's a little joke, but... You know what I'm saying? Like, but, in a tragedy like that, we we want niggas to go outside and be on some Stone Age shit. All right, we're going to get some twigs. We're going to get... Some niggas... Bro, 
I mean, Twig not gonna get you water. No, nah, I mean like like for the heat and shit. You know but, what I'm saying? Like, hey, we could use snow. We could use the mayor. Bro, hey. the mayor talking. Bro, the way the mayor was talking about like it's survival of the fittest is like like he on some like Hunger Game shit. But we can't, bro. We like. If we gonna New York well, look, as well. Look, if we yeah. gonna expect niggas to be this way, let's just call this shit a third world country. Let's call this shit Yo, let's just let's just let's just call it what it is. Let's if That's we gonna not how look third world countries if, are. That's one. Look, if two, we two, I've been to technically America got certain son, symptoms sure. of a third world country. Already. If we gonna expect niggas not to ever depend on the government for anything, like we need to just start calling this shit a new name then you know what I'm saying I can't expect the common folk niggas who are who are not you know you got niggas that grew up watching the news like niggas that's 80 years old you want no, them I to pull they I, boot, I you want them to pull they bootstraps up and say you know what I'm gonna start fucking they making my doing. own generators and, and I'm start, like these niggas depend on the government bro this is what it is while you were talking it made me think it like like the 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 Rockefeller, what is it? The Rockefeller Tavistock, right? The and the you know the Rockefellers with their fucking funding to funding into the healthcare system, funding into the educational system in the early 1900s, right? Mm -hmm. When you look at it, American citizens were groomed to be slowly become dependent on the government. And then now we're in a stage where we're slowly being taken off of that dependency. So right. now when you take a drug addict out of his drug, you got to go through that. What's the stage, that phase? Withdrawals. Withdrawals. Mm -hmm. So yeah. how our withdrawals is going to be violence because the withdrawals is no more basic living needs being met by the government. So now that state of dependence survival survival is going to turn into survival of the fittest it's going to turn into arrogance irrational thinking and behavior right. and all of that don't get so me that's wrong what, that's what they're doing don't get me wrong i agree with he's saying like yo just be prepared I, look i agree with you know just be stacked up on canned food just in case be stacked up on your water just in case Water. But like <laughs> but <laughs> what happens when that shit run out? What we what we supposed to be like? I right, fuck the government. You know what I'm well, saying fuck it. fuck 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 all the money I done put in taxes. Fuck fuck all the money I done paid to these companies to keep my lights on. I'm supposed to just go straight survival mode, like I'm on the middle of a fucking island. That's what but we see, telling niggas. That's what that's, that's what unrealistic. I'm, it's not practical. All right, but see, this is why I'm I, trying to tell this nigga that. This is why I be saying to you like, now. Nah, I have a mountain listen, of canned goods. Like this is why I be saying though. <laughs> eat, you you interpret. It's like nah, we was talking for a minute. I fully understand no, what this niggas. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about you and Steven. You interpret the government. Like at times you apply a moral like sense to them. Other times you you be like these niggas ain't shit. Like. That's how, like, that's how they are. Like, what can you assume? I'm speaking from... So, I'm saying... No, I'm speaking in terms of you can't... You saying you can't expect these people to just, like, fend for themselves out of the blue. That's what you're saying, right? Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. at the same time, you do you know how the level of how fucked up the government is? Yes, I know this. Okay, so how could you? I know this, the but same, I can't. But look, that's, that's what, it's I'm, only I'm two percent of niggas that's out right now. That's 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 going. That's woke right now. I'm only asking you, know you though. I'm asking you with you knowing. How, I'll be able to handle myself. Okay, all right. That's that's why I'll I was be able to handle at. myself. I'll be able to at. get shit done. If 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 we lost power or some shit, I'll be able to make sure me and my mom don't fucking freeze to death. If by the way, if we fucking run and, and we ain't had no food, I, I'll do what it takes to make sure we don't starve in this motherfucker. I watched you know the, I watched a video. Sorry to cut you off. Yeah. Man. Sorry to cut you off. I watched a video and this elderly black woman, I ain't tested this yet, but she with her grandchild showed how to charge your phone without electricity. Mm. You need a um, nine volt battery, um, a spring, the regular charge, the iPhone charger, of course, the charger card, mm -hmm. uh, car charger, and 
Yeah, that's it. So you put the charger, of course, your phone is plugged into, and then you take the other, plug that into the car charger. Now, the car charger, the bottom of it, you put it on the spring. The spring, you put it on top of the bigger the bigger circle on the 9-volt battery, and that's mm-hmm. how you charge it. Wow. See, shit like that, would be <laughs> shit like that is helpful. Yeah, you know what exactly. I'm like, if you lose electricity, exactly. you know what I'm saying? But I'm about to say is that, like, I honestly feel only 2% of the population is, like, really thinking how we think. Because if everybody... 5%. Okay, 5%. 5% nation. If everyone was thinking about this type of shit, then these niggas would be, like... We wouldn't even ha- fucking have politics. We wouldn't be in an illusion. Yeah. There would be no Wizard yeah, of Oz. We yeah, would have been pulled the be, yeah, curtain. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, I got to have sympathy and understanding of people. Like, I'm, I I can't just expect I do too. a family of a, a single mother of four to just- Who never was told this She may have canned goods, but like, you want her to, like, what's she supposed to buy a fucking generator? What, what's she supposed to, what, what, go- I don't know, go out and hunt for food or some shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, people say, what are we expecting like, from niggas that are just hardworking, normal folks? They're not into the woke shit. They, their mind is accustomed to, you know, I go to work, I do this, I do that. You know, of course, it's a, be- of course, what we doing, you better prepared, but my nigga, not everybody's, all right, so there's lions question. and there's sheep. All right. It's all in the circle of life, my nigga. I have a question. You know what I'm saying? Of all the sheep in America, how many you think are willingly sheep? Most. Majority. Majority. All right. Majority. So fuck them niggas. Nah, I can't, can't say that. Because this niggas no, are not. My sympathy is only for the ones who are. Honestly, that's like that. And I ain't no, going to no, be no, like, no, I'm no. going to let you die on the street because no, 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 you're no, a sheep. No, 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 no. You know what I'm saying? No, no. It's not just because the sheep label. The key was willingly. Willingly. The unwilling. It like, takes effort to nah, do what we do. No, no, no. On a but, daily basis. Shit get overwhelming. Check. No one order shit the government do. Shit it, get out of It does. Sometimes I sit and be like, damn, bro, like we really fucked here, bro. Sometimes like, I'll <laughs> sit and I'll be sad. But then the other side kicks. Some in people be can't like, handle that type. They just wanna they just wanna go to work <clears> and, and, and believe in the fantasy that the government gonna take care of them. Yeah. And I understand that shit. Me, I don't wanna believe in the fantasy. I'll be like, fuck that. I I'm out here in these streets trying to figure it out. I want the real. Yeah. But my thing is this though. My sympathy is for those who have never heard anything we've ever talked about or know as far as like the sadistic, the sinister side of, you know, government and all Mm -hmm. that, who's never, you know, came across like it's never came across their in their whole life. And they could they could have been like put up for adoption. They have no siblings, have no connection to parents. Right. They've. It's probably a single mother, single father, raising children on their own, trying to figure out life. They trying to figure out what the hell they got going on. They have no connection to a masculine nor feminine. So, dark shit that the government do or Hollywood and pedophilia, that's like the last shit on their mind. Yeah, they trying. Yeah, they try. prioritizing self and children. Right. Well, children and self. Because yeah. So now, my sympathy, yeah, 100% to people like that. Because you legit are oblivious, 100% oblivious. Mm -hmm. Now, those who have family members that treat their, like, Yui Freeman, and they react like Granddad and Riley, whenever Yui used to tell them, like, yo, this is... Like, they would legit look at the nigga and ignore the hell out of him. And then see the same shit he said manifest time and time again. Fuck them niggas. Like, what are we wasting time for? Like, <laughs> come on. We, what are we beating around the bush? Nah. Yeah. What the fuck? I come to you and OG. Give y'all both. No. Recruiter come to me, you, and OG. Tell us about a job opportunity. Monday. Two out of the three of us go. I'm not saying names, but two out of the three go. Or one out of the three of us go. Mm-hmm. A year later, two out of the three or one out of the three that, that did not take up the opportunity is homeless. Whose fault? Who? You see what I'm saying? No. Sure. We were all given the opportunity. Sure. That's a simplistic way to look at it. But sure, I, 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 get, I get exactly what you're saying. 
So we can't, nah. We, everybody, I get what you're saying. Everybody got that, like. But specifically to this thing, w- it's like this one more, one more thing I'm gonna say. Yeah. Everybody brain works. Everybody brain says shit like, that doesn't add up. That doesn't sound right. But we choose. Oh, she's pretty, so I'm gonna let that slide. Oh, he's attractive. I'm gonna let that slide. Oh, the government gives me a certain level of comfort i'm gonna let that slide but every time you let that slide she's gonna keep impeding more and more because you're not checking her he's gonna keep subjugating you more and more because you're not checking him the government Mm -hmm. gonna keep impeding more and more on your civil liberties because nobody's saying anything people who say things yeah few people say things and then they assassinate them Mm mm-hmm None of these people that really say things die of natural causes. Fact. So you can't tell me. That's why my question was, how many of you think are willingly sheep? So now it's like. We Actually, I take that back. I don't say majority. I say majority are willingly sheep. I say few are oblivious. The only reason why I say that is because I, <clears throat> bro, I know some people that like, even when they do see things, like they just, they still like oblivious. Like they just. They retarded. Like, That's like, the word for that. Like it's they're retarded. Shit. <laughs> and then they were like, nah, it's no way. Like they just they can't they can't fathom that the government is cloning niggas. They can't fathom that the government would would plan 9-11 to for his own benefit. Okay, so I get people they, like they that. They wouldn't even like they but like, they're they're they'll not literally watch though. the documentary. They're not and they'll be like, nah, it's no way. Okay, now nah, documentary you know I would get them too because they would be like, how oh, is that a fact? So no, nah, that having facts. No, nah, I I know I know based but on some certain, people like look. I understand what I you're saying. I would say if they see it in person and they still denounce and I were like, all right, like you look. I understand what you're saying, and like I said, I agree with some of the shit that that bitch ass nigga Tim Boyd said. <laughs> <laughs> I, I understand because look, like I just said, if 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 some shit was to go down and and we was and. And water wasn't running here. Yeah, you damn right. I'm going to the the I'm going to the corner store, and and I'm and I'm coming back with fucking mad water, and and if my mom isn't capable of you know taking care of herself, I'm boiling water. I, you know, I'm doing sun. What, I'm, what you have? To I'm do. googling shit how to make fire. I, I'm gonna figure it out. You know what I'm saying, but that's me though. There's some people that they don't have the wherewithal to. Even no way to begin because they got shit going on in their life. I got to have sympathy for them folks. You know what I'm saying? You just have to. I'd also say I'll have hit, I'll have sympathy for the folks who That's consume what I'm products that the government put ingredients that would basically mess with certain part, parts of the brain, which would probably be the initiative the cognitive the problem solving part of the brain because if we want to dumb down society i.e give them fluoride since the 60s 70s right if we want to dumb down society we're going to look up research you know research parts of the brain that has to do with critical thinking analysis and shit like that right okay if we already giving them crack that fuck up their teeth and they face and meth and all this shit why would we not give why would we not give them a drug that fuck up their shit internally that no one could say like point the finger and be like, right. hey, I got it from this person. You yeah. see? So right. yeah. those people too, I would give initiative, but yeah, mm, <laughs> the other ones, nah. Yeah. But all in all, yo man, I heard things are getting better in, in Texas. I think they got they got electric cool shit now. Mm. I think, you know, I think Biden finally and it's a, it's why I wish I was receiving yeah. was here on that because he he knew a little bit more shit. Mm-hmm. We need a uh, episode. Um, Joe Biden was he was very reluctant to send assistance the first week or so. Joe Biden has it's a lot of lot of shit. He's, that nigga's a demon, son. <laughs> very reluctant to do a lot of shit. Yeah, that he promised. Yeah, it's a, yo, we're gonna we're gonna have to <laughs> see on again. And because it's because I've been seeing he posted something and I have to get into Joe Biden right now because yeah fuck that nigga but he posted something about he posted like a he posted a post from somebody else that had all the shit that Joe Biden said he would do and then in red it said what he actually did and that nigga yo 
That nigga's a I don't I ain't gonna lie for everyone that voted for him, I understand you wanna get Trump out, it's but just understand. I want y'all to understand Ooh, this nigga yeah. is not good, son. <laughs> He's not a I good did. person, but moving on though. Brother with me, I ain't shooting. 